course, a big year in sports, especially when it came to Tim Tebow. Exactly. You got to love the fact that this guy gets drafted by the Broncos and the entire nation, you know, at least Broncos nation, kind of gets swept away mm -hmm. by him. And despite all of the criticism by NFL professionals, Tim Tebow was drafted in the first round by the Denver Broncos back in April of this year. But the response that it created could have never been expected. Here's a look at Tebow mania and our number three most exciting sports story of the year. With the 25th pick in the 2010 NFL Draft, the Denver Broncos select Tim Tebow, quarterback, Florida. No one saw it coming, but once the announcement was made, Tebow Mania hit hard. Coach McDaniels, he just said that he's looking uh, for everything that we had talked about in our meetings and everything that I was about, and uh, someone that's going to um, help the organization and just be a, a great role model there and a great leader there. Before the rookie could even sign a contract with the Broncos, his shoes and jerseys were flying off the shelves at athletic apparel stores. Just an extreme honor that people would want to wear uh, my jersey, even though I haven't ever done anything in it. He even signed a contract with jockey underwear. It hadn't even thrown a pass to the NFL, and he was already being treated like a football god. After all the hoopla sunk in, everyone's All-American finally signed a contract with Denver. Oh, I'm just excited. It's not really pressure. I just go out here and play football. He got his shots in the preseason and didn't take him long to take a snap during the regular season. Call the Wild Horse, their version of the Wild Kick. But as soon as the Broncos' year turned bleak, people began chanting Tebow's name and wondering why Josh McDaniels refused to let him throw a pass. But he finally got that shot against the Chiefs on November 14th. Second and goal. There we go. Here he goes, his first career touchdown pass. After being patient, he got his first start in the NFL. One problem, it was in the black hole of the Oakland Raiders. The Broncos lost that game, but Tebow showed great composure with a touchdown pass and no interceptions. So he got another first the next week. His first start at Invesco Field. Tebow mania was coming home. After a tough first half against Houston, the rookie helped put up 24 second half points to edge out the Texans 24 to 23. And the Broncos are an extra point away from taking the lead. And with one more start coming up this Sunday, it looks like Tebow Mania is here to stay.